Well, a much calmer weather pattern across the southeast compared to 24 hours ago when we were gearing up for the possibility of severe thunderstorms. We're not quite out of the woods yet in terms of a few isolated showers this evening. Here's why. There's a cold front out to the west along with an area of low pressure. It's a weak one and it will clear our area overnight tonight, but ahead of that frontal boundary, there's just a 10 to 20% chance of a few isolated sprinkles. And some of those showers that we've seen here across Dale County, as well as into parts of Coffee County, falling apart within the past few scans. That is generally due to a lack of instability in our region. Still, wouldn't be a bad idea to bring the umbrella with you if you're gonna be out and about this evening, in case you happen to run into one of those showers. Here's our hour by hour forecast. At 9 o'clock, a spotty shower or two, mainly north of Dothan, a little bit closer to Montgomery, and then all that activity comes to an end overnight tonight, and we should be dry by tomorrow morning. Outside right now in Dothan, it is 80 degrees. We have a southwest wind at 9 miles per hour. The dew point is at 69 degrees, so there is a certain mugginess in the air that you're feeling. It may actually feel a little warmer than the actual air temperatures. So most of us here across the Wiregrass, upper 70s to low 80s, 79 degrees in Enterprise, Geneva also at 79, 80 in Troy. It is 80 in Ozark and Eufaula is sitting at 81 degrees. Now for the next couple of hours, expect temperatures to fall back into the mid 70s. It will be a little humid out there. Notice the 20% chance of a passing shower through about nine o'clock. Tomorrow morning, we're going to wake up with some sunshine. Temperatures in the upper 60s out the door as you get yourself to work the kiddos off to the bus stop. By lunchtime, we're in the low 80s with a clear sky. That sunshine is going to warm us up pretty significantly during the second half of the afternoon. In fact, by 4 p.m., we're already at 87 degrees. So nice weather as we head to tomorrow and then again on Thursday. Friday, we're watching our next system start to move in. A warm front will lift north across the wire grass, so it'll be warm and unstable. We're expecting a line of thunderstorms to form sometime on Friday across north central Alabama and then work into the wire grass throughout the day. We still don't know exactly how strong those storms will be by the time they get here. A lot more detail to come over the next couple of days regarding this system, but showers, thunderstorms, they do linger into our Saturday. In fact, thunderstorms are likely throughout the day on Saturday. Finally, the system will start to move out by Sunday. Can't rule out a couple of morning showers. And then by Monday, we're warming right back up. 89 degrees, 90 for Tuesday. A summer-like pattern will start to set in by then.